guys welcome back to another vlog if you're new here karibu sana my name is Masi Sophie and kindly don't forget to hit that red subscribe button so guys i want to showcase you another airbnb um i want you guys to come along with me and see how amazing this house is well furnished and very good karibu sana and i think buddy you're going to take us through and show us all um detailed thing about this uh, house and how much it costs per night that are not here is food where the client is the one who buys whatever they want. These are the teacups, wine glasses, whiskey glasses, and your stuff are here. We have the plates and everything. And we have this amazing sitting area and we have our microwave here. We have the fridge here where you can store your things. And so, are you allow clients to come with their food? Yeah, clients are supposed to come with their everything. The only thing that we have provided for you is the fridge and the microwave. Okay, so the rest of the things you provide for yourself. Then, from there, this is our sitting area where you have entertainment. This is the area you have the television, you have music if you want to listen to music. Then we have the PS, you can see, uh, the pads are here, we have more than five pads, and then we have a bear necklace for the view. view, evening view, you really need to see the evening view, maybe we'll send a video the view, of yeah. the night view so that you can see how amazing Nairobi is, um, from there we have these tables, you can use one, you can put there if you have a lot of people who cannot fit at the other side. And then we have this amazing seat. Apparently the house is a little bit smaller so it can only fit, to make it comfortable, it can only fit one seat. Yeah, as you can see the seat is very comfortable. But then I want to ask how much this cost. Okay, so this seat was bought like a as a five seater but since the house is smaller only one seat could fit it was bought at around fifty five thousand that is why fifty dollars yeah amazing and these are basic for pillows and then the pro pillows I can't really remember the pro pillows but they were made just within the budget and then we have uh, this beautiful this art. beautiful art and then I don't know about the lights, the chandelier. Okay, initially we had a light like that one, the normal bulb. The normal bulb. This was what we did it ourselves for the house. Mm -hmm. You can see it really looks nice. Yeah. yeah. Then, um, what about the dining this, yeah. this is like a dining area, a chilling area. Actually, not a bedroom mirror. It was supposed to be a console mirror, but since it cannot fit in the sitting, the sitting will be so much congested. I decided to place it here. But I'm having an idea of putting a full mirror size so that people can be able to see themselves so, here. Yeah. And then you can see the artwork, the bedroom artwork, and then there's this light. Is it the, a bulb holder or not? Yeah, it's a bulb holder. Uh -huh. yeah. How so, much did that go for? Uh, I can't remember about this, but I got it at Kenyatta. What? The Maasai markets. Yeah. This one and the other light. Wow. I got them from the same place. Also, that's a light. Yeah, it's a light. Okay. Yeah. Let me just. Yeah, but 
this uh, vacuum cleaner uh -huh. uh, to clean the carpets. Yeah. So the client is the one to clean or you no. yourself? I'm the one who does the cleaning. I have a cleaning lady who comes in to do the cleaning. But most of the time I prefer having it here so that I can do it by myself. This bed is so good. Is it a 5 by 6? Bye bye.